Max Verstappen is the current Formula One champion. After he won the championship for the second time in a row, at only 25 years old, Verstappen has made his mark on the F1 world through his spectacular performances. At the same time, he's had his fair share of controversies. Max is well known for his aggressive style of racing, which is what we'll be talking about in this video. First off, what kind of driver is Max Verstappen? At the age of 16, Max Verstappen was blitzing through the F3 championships, winning six six consecutive races. Still only 25, Max has shown his winning personality throughout his career. So, what kind of driver is Max Verstappen? You could take a hint from this video talking about his controversies and assume he's an aggressive driver on the track. Max has always had a temper. Although it's pretty controlled now, it does shine through at times. Son of former Formula One driver Joss Verstappen, Max has always had a feel for racing. You don't become F1's youngest ever driver without any natural talent. And Max has has always had plenty of it. Sky Sports' Martin Brundle spoke about what makes him such an amazing driver, saying that Max has always had wisdom beyond his age. Brundle spoke about the confidence that Max has exuded since he had just joined the sport. No doubt this confidence has taken him all the way to the top of the Formula One world. Brundle spoke more about Verstappen's aura and how he was always sure of himself and his ability to be one of the best drivers in the world. It's apparent in the way he drives on the track Max Verstappen has a lot of tenacity, doing any anything he needs to win. This has worked against him more than a few times, but it's also what has driven him to become a world champion two years in a row. The aura Max has been able to create for himself is apparent in how he drives, doing anything and everything to win while having full confidence in himself. Next up at number 6 on the list, Max's first major controversy. Going all the way back to 2016 in Belgium at the age of 19, Max Verstappen was cementing his place as one of the best in the world, showcasing his aggressive of driving style. That's exactly what caused this moment of controversy, as Verstappen was rubbing shoulders with both Ferrari drivers at the time, Sebastian Vettel and Raikkonen. Max made a bold move on turn one as he stuck to the inside, forcing Sebastian Vettel to the left to avoid clashing with Verstappen. This led to Vettel coming into contact with his Ferrari teammate Raikkonen, instead making him spin out. Remember when he said Max was always an aggressive driver? This is what we meant. The Dutchman will always do whatever it takes to win. In. Later on in the race, Verstappen would move in front of Raikkonen to block him from overtaking. This caused the Ferrari driver to break rashly in order to avoid crashing. This was the first time Verstappen was seen as the focus of the controversy as fans of the sport debated whether his actions were justified or not. Kimi Raikkonen had some harsh words for Max after the race, as he blamed his rash driving for the incident. Verstappen denied any dangerous driving allegations, brushing it off as he defended his position. He even said that Kimi Raikkonen was just moaning about something that was legal. It's a big lie. I was defending my position. If someone doesn't like it, that's their problem. It's ridiculous. Coming up next at number 5, we've gone for Hungary in 2017. A year after his introduction to the F1 world as an aggressive driver, Max was again caught up in controversy. It should be noted that Max is still only 25 years old. That means that he was only 20 years old when this race took place. At such a young age, it can be pretty easy to let some pressure get to you, and sometimes appear a little too eager. Over-eagerness is what caused Max Verstappen to crash into his own Red Bull teammate, Daniel Ricciardo. After having a reputation for being a risky driver, this one really cemented his style as an F1 competitor. Max made an error going into turn one as he was pushed wide by Valtteri Bottas, and he needed to make up for the time. This was probably his inexperience at the time showing, but Max tried to make up for his earlier error by pushing hard into turn two. He ended up crashing into his teammate Ricciardo and getting a penalty. Max was handed a 10 second time penalty and drew the anger of his teammate as well. Daniel called Max's actions amateurish after the race. Again, we have to attribute the lapse in judgment to Max's age at the time. He was still learning, and we can imagine the pressure of learning while facing off against the best in the world. It probably was an amateurish move on Max's part, but he's only learned from such mistakes since then. Moving on, we've gone with China 2018 as number 4. For anyone questioning why Max Verstappen had such a reputation for being a bit of a troublemaker, this was his third controversy in three straight years. This time, the Dutchman sparked controversy involving Sebastian Vettel's Ferrari yet again. Just like the previous year, this collision was caused by Max's own overeager attitude, as he tried to make amends for a mistake earlier in the race. Max's car was forced off the road during a struggle with Lewis Hamilton, making him lose ground. He was 
was fighting for third place, neck and neck with Sebastian Vettel, when he got the tail end of Vettel's Ferrari. The collision caused Vettel to spin out and subsequently finish seventh in a disappointing result. Vettel was even looking to add to his championship run, but ultimately couldn't due to the clash. Meanwhile, Verstappen was given a 10 second penalty, which saw him finish in fifth himself. Unlike the previous controversy involving Verstappen and Vettel in 2016, Max took full responsibility this time around. Many people expected the hot headed Dutchman to come out and say it wasn't his fault. On the other hand, Verstappen showed great maturity in admitting his mistakes. The Dutchman acknowledged that he locked his car's rear and hit Vettel, noting that he should have waited before trying to overtake the Ferrari driver. Coming up at number three, we went for Britain 2021. Fast forward to 2021. Verstappen is now 24 years old and challenging for Formula One championship. Fighting for the Formula One crown means you're now battling it out with one of the sport's greatest, Lewis Hamilton. Hamilton's the current record holder for most championship wins, and he's established himself as arguably the greatest ever to do it. Max Verstappen has been going head to head with the Brit for the past few years, and his tenacious persona has definitely helped. This is the first controversy on the list where Verstappen was on the receiving end. Max was leading the race till Hamilton's front left tire caught Verstappen's rear and caused him to veer off into the barriers. Hamilton was only given a 10 second penalty as he went on to win the race. Meanwhile, Max had to retire from the race prematurely and was taken to the hospital. Verstappen spoke about the incident after his checks at the hospital. The 24 year old was upset with the race events and mentioned how it was upsetting to lose so many points for someone else's mistake. He also added that he was in good health and felt great going into the rest of the season. Max also spoke about Hamilton's team and how they celebrated after the win. He found it very disrespectful to see them celebrating a win that came after sending someone to the hospital. That's what I found really disrespectful, and in a way, it shows how they really are. It comes out after a pressurized situation, but I wouldn't want to be seen like that. Next up, we've got our number two pick. Another one from 2021, and once again, it involves Lewis Hamilton. These two are the best in the world right now, and it shows when they constantly compete for the top spot. The rivalry is real. This time in Monza, Max Verstappen was once again paying for his over-eagerness to win. Coming out of a pit stop, Max wanted to overtake Hamilton as quickly as possible. As the two approached a high-speed corner, Max was forced wide while trying to overtake and ended up hitting the curb. His car was flung up into the air and crashed on top of Hamilton's Mercedes in a horrifying fashion. The car narrowly missed Hamilton's head, and the collision ended the race early for both competitors. Stewards and fans blamed Max Verstappen for the collision, as he was the one who sped into the turn to overtake. He was also heavily penalized with the loss of three grid positions. Finally, our number one pick for the list. This time in Brazil, 2021 was a crazy year for both Max Verstappen and Lewis Hamilton. Their rivalry reached new heights as Brazil marked the third time they'd be involved in a controversy together. This time around, Max was defending his championship lead and was looking to while Hamilton was trying to overtake during the 49th lap of the race, Verstappen forced him wide in desperation. Hamilton's car was forced off the tracks after the move, but he could pull it back superbly. Hamilton still won the race after a fantastic comeback, returning from 10th place to finish on top. He sped past Verstappen with 12 laps to go and didn't look back for the rest of the race. Max Verstappen is the world's best right now, edging Lewis Hamilton to consecutive titles. At the same time, he's always had a knack for being a risky and aggressive driver. He's had a temper since he had just started out, and it still shines through from time to time. At the same time, that tenacity might be exactly what has driven Max to his world titles at the age of only 25. That's a wrap for today's video. What do you think of Max Verstappen's aggressive and tenacious mindset? Let us know in the comments below, and be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe if you want more content just like this, and we'll see you next time.